What up, people? And if you've heard it enough, but Merry Christmas. If you want, if you wanted Treyarch to give you any Christmas present for Call of Duty, what would it be? I know what I'd want, but we know Treyarch is not capable of pulling things off like this. Neither is Infinity Ward. But you, it's I'm talking about camping. If you have, if you haven't caught on, you know it comes to me that I haven't gave a kind of a review of this game. I haven't been doing my commentary, so because I've been, it's been my dreaded capture card, which you know and I know I need to replace. But I also been uh, uploading videos about a talented boy. He's made it all the way to 15th prestige. By the way, shout out to him. But, <coughs> let's stay on topic. Let me be the first one to say that they still haven't took camping out, that's for sure. The nukes are off, which could impact some of the campers, but very few. A lot of players, let's be honest, play for a good kill-death ratio. The obsession of having a 2.0 for a fresh start just boggles deep in their mind. Again, it takes no skill to sit in a corner... Neither does it take to sitting in a room with claymores guarding your rear end. But if it's an ex exploit of the game, people are going to use it. A presidor calls them groundhogs. I simply call them cowards. I mean, watching their teammates run into the battlefield while sitting back protecting your KD? Uh, think about it. It's not very patriotic whatsoever. I mean, let's get real. You don't even camp in the campaign. This community lacks the COD spirit, which is run and gun and have fun. So, so what happened to our fun community? We miss. I mean, what happened to the fun community two years ago? Because I think it was Modern Warfare 2, because that's where the camping started heavily. But I'll see what you have to say. Just drop it in the comment box. When I first started this game, when I first started on Black Ops, I told myself I was going to have a better KD than I did on Modern Warfare 2. Didn't happen. I kept dying, so I, I began to camp, which turned into a disaster because I, I just got bored. I took some steps and then dead. I just... It's not really fun to me. I don't I don't see how people can camp. It's weird. I mean, it's not that I'm... I'm not a hyper person. I'm, really, I'm just really relaxed when I play this game. If I'm getting, if even if I'm getting beat legitly, if people are beat beat me, and they're not camping, it doesn't bother me. I'll stay relaxed. But if I'm getting camped, my head will start to spin. I mean, I can't stand campers whatsoever. I, did you just see that napalm? I didn't even touch it. That I need to fix that touching napalm. You should be able to go through it. <sighs> but you know. This uh, combat record, I think it's the coolest thing, combat record. You, when you're in a match, just look for people's combat records, you know. And, uh, just, like, I, what, what I do when I get into a match, a lot of people, like a big group of party, just look through their combat records. I look for a 3.0 or maybe a 2.0, it doesn't matter, I still camp for KDs. And, uh, I, uh, just mute them. Mute them or back out. It's that simple. It works for me. <coughs> Another little glitch. One out of glitch. The next point I don't like is a second chance. Not only you got players moving, but you got players revived when you're down into a last stand position. I've lost a lot of kills over this. It's does it make me too happy? The the lagging issues. I've always had bad connection. Wyoming connection is not the greatest. Uh, should have checked that guy in the corner. Come on, Winter. But a lot of people. It would have been still been better if they put dedicated servers. I mean, dedicated servers. This game would have hit the books easily. Kill streaks are, uh, I'd say a few are unbalanced. 
The chopper gunner is definitely at an 11 kill streak. I've, I've been in to the hind and I've been in the chopper gunner. That chopper gunner can get way more kills than the hind. Either switch those or just put that chopper gunner to an 11th kill streak because it is way unbalanced. Nine kill streak, no. Napalm, napalm's all right. Stay, keep it where it's at. But the the tiny glitches where you don't even touch the flame, you don't even see the flame. I mean, you seen that napalm where it got me through the roof? Come on, there's some there's some flaws right there to that napalm. But one thing you did accomplish, which I really liked, was the was the kill streaks won't stack up. Well, I mean, I don't know how you say it. kill streaks won't give you other kill streaks. Remember on Modern Warfare 2, you got the Pred, then you get two kills, you get your little Harrier, then from there you get your Chopper Gunner. It doesn't do that no more. You gotta actually use your gun. Even towards your kill streaks, or, or your overall kill streak. Like mine's a 14, but I know I went uh, probably 10 and 0. Or not 10 and 0. What the hell am I saying? Probably 20 and 0, but I got a lot of kills with the Choppers and Mortars. But it says I got 14 kills. So, I mean. That's all right there. But, I gotta tell you, this combat record brought a lot of things in. Like, you can tell all your kills per weapon. I mean, that, that is pretty cool right there. I mean, I did on World of War with the Call of Duty headquarters, and who knows. A lot of people tell me, play bare bones because there's no campers there because you got no kill streaks. Well, all you have is Team Deathmatch and Free For All there, and I'm not really a big fan of that. I'll see the game mode I'm playing right now. I'm a domination player. And. Damn. What the f how did I not kill that guy? That is RC got, got me. RC just. Not my favorite. I get a lot of those sons of bitches up my asshole. Taking Charlie. Can I take it or will I not? Nope. That Warren guy gets me. I don't know why. He just, I find his gun at the, my face every time on this map. Looking at Charlie, looking at Charlie. I'm being skeptical there, but if, if I wanted one thing, Treyarch. If I wanted Treyarch to give me one present for Call of Duty, I would take camping out. 